Okay, so quick video on how to do two color printing, which is super fun. So uh, one of the most fun things to do is two color printing and you can do it with a single nozzle. You don't need a special uh, printer to do this. In fact, you can do multiple colors. The trick is you lay down different colors in different heights. So if I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and tinker this, I'm gonna tinker my everyone does everything placard. And so you can kind of see there it has multiple heights. So what I want to do is I'm gonna make the base one color and the text another color. So I'm gonna go export, just like usual. Export everything as STL. I'm gonna get my STL. And that's gonna download it and I'm going to run it into Prusa Slicer. So I'm gonna open up Prusa Slicer and then I'm gonna put my recently sliced two color demo right here. There it is. Now, if I sliced it right now with one color, it would look like this and it would just, you know, normally print, 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 print. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do multiple colors. So what you need to do is tell the printer when to stop and ask you for a new color. So I'm gonna come down here and notice the plate, I'm gonna zoom in a little bit. Notice the layers are dropping, 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 dropping. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make this layer right here a different color. So click, everything below it is gonna be one color and then this is gonna be another color. Then I'm gonna bring it up again where the text starts and I'm gonna click a third color. So what's gonna end up gonna happen, gonna happen is your, this base is gonna be one color, this box is gonna be another color, and the text is gonna be a third color. If I want to, I can even make one, one of the texts a different color. You notice the animation is higher than the, than the uh, PCHS 2021. So what's gonna happen right here is it's gonna send what's called an M600 command to the printer. And that's gonna pause the printer and it's gonna ask you to uh, for, for input. So basically you're gonna pause and you wait to press a button and while it's paused, it'll eject the filament and you can put in new filament. So I'm gonna slice it right now. And with these commands, you'll notice up here, it says color change after one hour, 11 minutes, and it's gonna print. There's gonna be another color change after 56 minutes. So this is going to make a three color print. Color one, color two, color three. I'm just gonna export that to my eight gig card like normal. And then I'm gonna eject it and send it to the printer.